look at that all gun box. You got something. My man. What's up, Steven? What's up, man? Man, we here at the uh, Jefferson. Thank you. We here at the Jefferson Library. My no brother. Thank you. My man. Yo. Thank you. You're welcome, man. Peace Yo, up. man. Giving out. This is the way you take care of community. You take care of our own people, man. You feel me? We down here at Jefferson Library making sure everybody have a nice Thanksgiving. No matter what. So we down here. We got four locations. We down here at the Jefferson Library until four. My brother, thank you. Jefferson Library. We're also um, at the uh, library on, on Ross Street in Batavia. Shout out to Just Kings. I'm about to head up there in a few minutes. They about to hold us down there. Then we're headed over to Lockport YMCA. The big YMCA, the new one. That's where we be for, for that one. And the Niagara Falls Underground Railroad Museum is right next door to Amtrak and Niagara Falls. Four places. We are doubling what we did last year. This is this is important. Look at the sheriff is here, rocking with us. The sheriff department by themselves have donated 58 turkeys. You feel me? Shout out to Mike and his beautiful wife. Yo, listen, man. This is this is how you take care of your community. And you know what? People say I've heard, I've heard I've heard murmurings about oh delicious turkeys and it's that. But you understand when people have been through so many things and they can't even afford to put I've had calls back to back this morning of people saying how can I get a turkey the gentleman that we just left he wouldn't even be on camera I don't blame him it's all good my man walked from Shirley just to be here so he could get a turkey for his family and then he had the nerve to help us like what like you know what I'm saying like we gotta stop looking at the, the small things like giving away turkeys or doing a turkey giveaway as just being a small feat. And then we also have to do other things that continue to let people know that we're here in the community. We got boots to the ground. We're doing, we doing our own thing. Forget trying to get with all these big organizations. And I, This is the second year we've done this without any banks. The banks told us that we, we don't like bedlam in your name. So I'm like, what you want me to do, change the band name? I'm not gonna do that. So this is the second year we've done it by just personal donations from the good community. This is how you be the, the city of good neighbors. That's how you do it. That's how you put the sauce on it. And, and now we got the sheriff back in us too. So what's up? What you got to say next year when the third year anniversary of the inner city? This, this started as just something because people were afraid to come out of their house to go to the store because of 514. It exploded into something that is beautiful for ever, for now four, three counties and four cities. And next year, we're gonna expand the two more cities. We're gonna add Rochester on it. We're gonna have Lackawanna on it. You feel me? The inner city bedlam is unstoppable. You feel me? It's not just about music, it's about community engagement. And that's what we about. We are the inner city bedlam. Join us.